This is you singing in the shower yesterday. This is you goofing around with your friends last weekend. And this... This is you creating with thousands of people. We are Kululam, the global mass singing experience. Here's how it works. We'll teach you a new take on one of your favorite songs, and then you'll perform it live. This is what it looks like. This is what it sounds like. But to know what it feels like, you'll have to be there. Hi, welcome to Zusammen, a new episode. Hi, TP. Hi, Tilly. And everybody knows that we are here because we would like to reach our brain, to, make, you know, to enrich ourselves. So we invite everybody that we think can inspire us. And who can inspire us more than... Or... Oh. Oh. <laughs> She's giving me a zest with the knee. <laughs> or oh, Teicher, uh, the founder of Kululam. Or oh, Kululam. What's Kululam? What is it? Uh, what is it? Uh, so Kululam is a, a social initiative for co-creation. Um, we bring people together from all cross of life uh, um, just to, to connect them through music. Um, Kululam is actually, uh, um, the, let's say that our general uh, product is a mass singing event. Uh, we are trying to bring people through tools of arts, um, a ma mass singing event that's attended by thousands of people, uh, like uh, concert music, people buy tickets coming to our concert, and we teach them a well-known song with a new arrangement in three vocals, less than 45 minutes. We record it, we film the, uh, we film the, the, the song, the people sing the song, and then we release it to the world as a message. Um, I see, you know, I see it as a social activism through music because you really hug a huge community trying to elevate them to a, a, a nice place of feeling good about themselves and the rest and give a message to everybody that it can be done in a different way. So that's how I see them and I see you guys. But I want you, I want you to talk about the name because many people mm -hmm. don't know that Kululululululam and where it comes from, where like yeah. we know, but you know. So I am, a, I am one founder then uh, through, uh, from, uh, we are three founders in Kululam. Uh, uh, one is Ben Yefet, is the conductor with the curly hair that you see jumping on the stage uh, in our clips. And uh, our second uh, a partner, uh, she's named her, her name is uh, Michal, Michal Shachaf. And, uh, uh, and we, we, we thought together about the name. Um, when we just create, created Kululam, we thought, we thought we need to find a name that will fit for what we are trying to do. And we are trying to create a new language, a new culture, a new social language. And we, we, we looked for, for a name that, that doesn't exist uh, in any culture, but have some, you know, have some- uh, Ingredients. Um, yeah, something that will uh, will have a minute a meaningful for us. So we started about the name. Uh, we, we we thought about the uh, ululation. Yes. And what we like about it that in in one in one um, uh, let's say uh, uh, that um, culture. Uh, it's a, it's a call of epinets, yes. and in one culture is what do you say? It's spontaneous. Yes, and in and in one culture is a voice of really deep sad, sadness, and we like the gap and the connection between that, that this word is living in the same like 
through uh, happiness to sad sadness. And uh, so we thought about the Kululu and Michal, my, my uh, uh, partner, thought about the name Kululam. And actually Kulam every- in Hebrew, it's everybody. Yes, Kulam in Hebrew is everybody. And Kululululu, it's basically, uh, uh, it's, it goes between the Sephardic cultures from the Arab countries and Kulam yes. is everybody in Hebrew. So if yes. you put together the Kululululu with Kulam, that's what you yes. get. Yeah. You're right. <laughs> but, we, but, but because it's a new, a new world that we just invaded, invited, so I don't care. Everybody, everyone can get his own um, meaning for the, you know, for the word, and it's okay. So people who come, uh, they don't know each other, right? No, people don't like. People don't know each other. We are bringing, uh, you know, people coming as a strangers coming as a, a group of people that don't know each other, don't know what they are going to, uh, what they are going to experience. And after two hours of event, they are, they are, let's say, um, I don't know how to say it in, in English, kvutsa um, megubeshet. cohesive group, group, yeah. With, uh, that own a, a creation together, a co-creation. And, and, and this is something really special. Uh, all, all what we try, all, all what we're trying to do is, is actually to take people for a journey, for experience. Um, because one of the uh, uh, the vision of Kululam is 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 not the music. The music is only a tool. Yeah. Is to bring people the strength and 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 the ability to. To believe their in in their self, that they have the ability to change the reality if they just want it. And it's a lift up. It's really a lift up experience. But you know, or um, you graduated from film school in Israel, Sam Spiegel. Yes. And long time ago, when we were talking about the move from the school to Kululam. Uh, yeah. You said that you're influenced by the gathering of the Hasidic Jews, the ultra-Orthodox glue to another, uh, which only thinking about it gives so much power. You know, unfortunately, lately we saw some bad side effect of this gluing. You know, they had few terrible accidents in Israel yes. uh, because of this, uh, this power of group. But... I don't think that there is any experience of seeing uh, a, a whole community coming together around a rabbi, praying and singing together. It's and I like, yeah. remember when you when you said you you talked about it, you said this is what brought me to bring everybody together just differently. What happened? I really, really curious about uh, all the. Uh, religions ceremonies around the world, not only in the Jewish uh, community. They have something so powerful there yeah. because actually people will, you know, in the Bible said that, that Itzhak will kill his son just to prove God, his loyal, loyalty. And commitment, yeah. Commitment. And they have something there so powerful i see people with the with their faith and i see their eyes i see they are strength strength they are so powerful and 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 strong with their with their uh belief and and i ask and i ask myself if we can if if we can take this prayer and to make them as a social prayer, to, to, to use this power as community and to change as community reality that we are not feeling enough good, like that, that with reality that are not making- Not orthodox. In... Not orthodox. Yes, I, I, actually I'm a secular and, and I'm, 
honestly, I'm a bit far from from any uh, religion um, habits, let's say. And, and in the same time, I'm feel I, I I'm feeling like the the most uh, uh, strong Orthodox that I know because in my heart, God is lead me like but but is my god like is 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 my it's from my energy together. so what grew them together is god yeah. and when you get all these thousands of people who don't know each other um this is not god i mean the desire that they come together um i'm not sure even if they come and understand the full extent of the bonding um and the connection between them but so it, you know and it's more it's i think it's more complex the, the need to come together and sing a song that they didn't know before that you are teaching them right right we are we, 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 we are or i think that all of us as non-orthodox people uh i don't think we can really understand the level of uh, um power that they feel and you can see it in the gospel uh churches you can see it, much before the um, tribes the, the tribes tri used to and you can get the whole tribe together. um in the forest and you can yeah. see really people and you can see it in africa yes music is leading them to get them to god for for what you're talking and correct me if i'm wrong it's like your music is your god so basically no, is in a way so. i think that what he what the, the comparison is for him is to bring people together the music I, is a tool. I, the, the music the music is a tool let's say that uh, our music is like the bible okay um is like the prayer of of, of like people praying um what really uh what really interests me in, in, in that is, is actually the community, is actually the, 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 the group. I know that when, you know, people are in 2021 with the technology, with, with the Facebook, with the WhatsApp, with, with all the, 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 the technology group around our head, we are so divided and disconnected that that we are losing our power. We are charging our, our, our products around us, but every time that we are charging our phone, we are losing our power, our soul power. And I don't say don't use this technology, it's amazing, it's, it's connecting us in, in other ways, but we have to, we have to find the balance. You know, in one, in one hand, I see Kululam as the Barzalim of the 70s. In, in Israel, I remember that well, my father- Yeah, don't my know father, what Barzalim means. Barzalim, it was a company. Is, yeah. is, is, to, is to sitting in the block. So, no, he's sitting on the Barzalim in the, on the street that everybody is sitting together in yes, the street. Uh, right. the, yeah. my, my father all the time told me when I was a child that when he was in my age, nobody, um, nobody uh, text or or try to I don't know. Let's go to there. Let's go. He said every Friday we 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 met in the same hour in the same Barzalim, in the same the same okay, point it's, it's on the really, street. Places that we could just hang around. It's not a yes. place. It's a, how do you yeah. say? A, a, we'll find like a aluminum thing that. Yeah. yeah. So um, and and we and everybody like gathering there like a fence in the street that yes. divides the street from the road. And yes. we used as the teenagers, we used to sit on that, and then slowly, yes. slowly, everybody gathered together. And at the time, Israel was small, and everybody just went down to the neighborhood and gathered. Later on, um, usually the teenagers who were a little bit lost or they had nothing to do um uh, used to sit and then 
a, a, all kind of uh, organization used to collect them and help them to find their way. But this was a very strong thing in the street culture of Israel. But you know, uh, you talk about, you know, the media and Facebook and all this, maybe part of what drove you, not when you talk about, you know, social activity is also to hear the voices of other people. Because when we text, we don't hear our voice. We don't hear anybody's voice. And we need to hear our voice. We need to really produce those sounds. And more than that, we need to listen. And feel it and feel yeah. the voices, yeah. We need something you know, it, to come it, back it, to us. Yeah. It, it's interesting when you are talking about uh, all the social media, because actually the social media is, is you know, just helping um, in some way to divide us, to to to, to hide to hide uh, uh, ourselves behind the computer. But we choose the social media to lead a message. To to we we, we took the people, uh, we take them out of their couch for to, to meet each other. But then we create a a, a video clip as a is that the, the people holding an agenda there, a social agenda, a social message. You know, it's remind me uh, our video clip that's called One Day. Yeah. One, one Day is a video clip that we, we hold, a, we hold an event in Haifa mm -hmm. um, four years ago. Wow. Yeah. Haifa is a is a coexistent uh, uh, um, mixed, uh, city, yeah, yeah. Mixed. mixed city that that live there, a Muslim, Christian, and Jews together. And we we went there to to create an event with th three thousand participants of uh, Muslim, Jews, and Jewish that. They, 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 they sing together uh, uh, one day by Matisseau in three languages, in Arab, uh, English, and Hebrew. And this is, was a really, really inspired uh, uh, event. And I really, I believe that it's a fact on their 3,000 participants that took a part. But what happened? after that this video was traveling around the world, it's an amazing story because this video just, so many places in the world that had, have conflict, choose this video of Kululam, the take of Kululam to, um, how I said, uh, to Leatseg, Le, le uh, le to, pre to present their voice. For example, um, the, the war, the, 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 the Sylvian war that uh, uh, going now in Myanmar, for example, yeah. uh, we saw something amazing in Kululam. They, the, 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 the people in Myanmar, they took the, the Kululam one day and they are using this voice is their anthem, anthem for their fight against the army that killing the civilians in the streets. They take this song and make with this song a protest and video clip and, and, and they are using this song for the world to take a notice. And, 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 this, and like that, it's happening in so many places in the world. And I'm, I'm okay. really proud about it. But what my question is, I did a film about the punk rock group called the uh, uh, Lucy Spussy. <laughs> and uh, yeah, and the reason why I decided to make a film about them is because I saw some of, the, because their Solius was killed in a suicide bombing, but I, I saw one of their songs and it was an extremely um, protest song. And then they really express how they feel about society and what, what they wish. And everything in, in my case, I really identified with what they said. So my question to you is how do you choose your songs? Mm. And 
how, what leads you to choose a certain song and believe it will combine or reach thousands of people, not speaking about other societies? Let's, let's go one step before choosing a song because it will lead us why we are choosing that song. Um, when we are uh, trying to create event, the first thing that we are doing is to, is to find the agenda. What is the social agenda that we are want to hold in this event and why? What we are doing in Kululam, first, in personal, uh, to the participants, in, in, in personal uh, view, we are trying to connect between their mind to their heart. We are trying to attempt their sensitivity for their an envir environment and for their self, to, to expand their, their self-listening. This is first. Our second goal, we are people coming to our event, and then after two hours of event, they are going out with a social agenda that maybe they didn't hold before the event. Maybe it's a social agenda about coexistence between Arab and Jewish. Maybe it's an agenda about uh, uh, people with disabilities that are uh, trying to, uh, to, um, uh, to raise awareness. Yeah. yeah, and maybe it's about commonality, right? Uh, so many, so many uh, uh, ways for a social agenda. Sometimes it's a, a woman in power, powering, and, and and more and more. So. When we are choosing what the social agenda that we are holding in that event, this is what leads us to find the song. Because the song is the script, yes. like a movie, is the script of the event. Is the, is the words is are rep representative the people, the participants that singing this message to the world. And sometimes, like, a, a, like a, a actors that that acting in a movie, we are taking in our um, arrangement. We are making some moves that will put a light in places that we want on the song. For example, if I want uh, in one day, he said, "Stop with the violent uh, down to the down the eight, and we 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 we. Creating the arrangement to do stop with the violence. The people will 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 shout in this word. So we are we are we are choosing uh, with. In one hand is is the words of the song, and in the other hand is is actually the arrangement that that make the um, the light in in places that we want on the song. You know, um, you know Tippy that. I had a, a wish, and the or knows about wish for a long, long, long time, that with all my our peace simulations in the center in Israel, uh, we will have uh, one peace simulation between musicians, musicians from Israel, Palestine, and uh, from outside of the world, exactly like the Emmy School, that how the the way we set it up, which is international, school. which is in an international school, and then. Uh, we thought to that part of the because it was important for me for these people to understand that it's maybe easy to write music but not that easy to talk I mean to talk to each other but then I wanted them to write together a piece that would be the anthem of all wow. the three simulations and then go back to Haifa because we we did it with the University of Haifa and we were supposed to have another one with the University of Haifa with Truman Institute, with students from the West Bank, with students from the Jerusalem, with Emmy students, with international students at Haifa. And after the big simulation to have everybody singing this anthem with Kululam and use it every year. And it's, I hope still that one day we can do it, that we can really- okay together to do it and create this anthem and have the whole University of Haifa with every everybody you know and all the other institutes uh, to sing it and use it every year. This was my, yeah. really so, a big wish. So tell me, so you pick up an existing 
songs and just do the a new arrangement? Or you yeah, a well a well known song, and and we will yeah, and we we we. We create a new arrangement, a unique arrangement. Um, and you don't and change it. What is it? You don't change the song. No. No. We, 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 no. It, it, it's an issue of rights and all that. So we, and, and we, and, but what we try to do is to, uh, I think you said, renew the song, like, like to, to take it in a new... Um, yeah, once you change the yeah, yeah. many times, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so you, you, uh, you say, to approach different musicians and ask for a certain song, right? What do you mean? How do you get this song? I mean, you need to get a permission. Yes. Or, yeah. But it's all in here. Yes, yes, yes. But, but, but you, no? you get, no, wait, you take, you, you uh, go to a, a, a Hebrew, song arabic song english song or you you get no, it's, song it, and it, then it, you it. it okay uh, so kulam is actually uh, we're performing um we had we 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 lucky enough to performing in a lot of places in the world and the most amazing in this concept that we can do it in every language uh -huh. So uh, if we are in Brazil, we are having a Portuguese song. And if we are in uh, China, we are making a Chinese uh, song in, in Chinese. And if we are in, uh, in Spain, we do it in, in, in Spanish. So it's, it depends the, the places that we are making the event. And usually we are approach the, um, we are approach the, uh, the, 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 the the writer or the person that have the right of the song, the, and um, yeah, we are collaborate with them. And once we are touring the world already, can you take us to Indonesia and tell us mm. what happened? And then to the pop. Tippy, <laughs> <laughs> uh, you want to go? You, you know, yeah, you don't have. Uh, you, I know it's okay. No, you I, 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 you know, I have different voices, and I'm waiting to hear the yeah. orchestration. Um, you know, Indonesia, it's a really, um, it's really amazing story because um, the events that we are creating is, 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 is really, I'm, I'm, I'm sure it's something that look really nice, but, but again, for us is only a tool. What we are trying to do is to take people uh, from their automatic language, to take them a one step from their comfort zone and to help them in, 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 in that moment to leave their automatic language and to help them to, to open their mind for maybe a different perspective of, on life. And Indonesia is really amazing example in what happened. Um, for the Israeli 70s Dependent Day, we, uh, we, we, we create an a event with our uh, president, Ruven um, Rivlin. And uh, we, we, we create an a event with 12,000 participants and the president that was uh, sitting with all the citizens of Israel in the same place. This is, was one of our condition. If we will do an event together, you will be the, 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 the first, uh, how you said this, the, the first um, resident? No, the- The first president to, to open it because he opened the whole uh, yeah. The event. Yeah. In, in opening the event and, and uh, we released this video uh, and, after that, uh, this video just, you know, like like I said before, just yeah, travel in the world, and 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 got the attention of the a spiritual leader of Indonesia. He is like the the Pope of the Christian. Is like the Pope for the 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 
the Sun Mus the, the Muslim Sun, uh, uh, Muslimim Sunni. The, How? the Muslim, the Sunnis Muslims. The Sunnis Muslims. And uh, he saw this video and he was really amazed that the president of Israel standing with his people and singing together with them. And he, uh, he, 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 after he saw this video, he, 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 con he connected us, he, 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 he okay. called us, contacted us, and, and asking if we can do this event in Indonesia. <laughs> and because he wanted to, he want to bring an uh, example to his, to his people in Indonesia, like we did in Israel. And um, of course, it was, is a bit, uh, um, uh, is a bit uh, a country that we cannot go in, right? Israelis cannot go to Indonesia. Yeah, it was a country that that Israelis yeah. cannot be uh, come inside. And uh, after uh, uh, speaking, uh, we uh, and after we we talk with him, uh, he arranged a, a, a first historic um, uh, tour in Israel to come to Israel because he wants to, uh, to feel and to experience a Kululam event. And uh, we, uh, he came here for one week, he, he met with the president, he met with the prime minister. And in the end of his uh, week, it was the last day of the Ramadan and the first day of the uh, the uh, uh, Elul month for for the Jewish is like um, end of the summer, yeah. Yes, and uh, we 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 create event in the uh, uh, David Tower in Jerusalem. Uh, uh, how we said a irua irua dati lo irua spiritual ben, ben ah between between different religions yes we, we, was we, a, we had, i remember that it was an, an event with the president with a, a representative of all the religious and they did a, a together a, a together a yeah event for everybody the event started at midnight because we, we, we wanted that the Ramadan will finish. It started at midnight and it finished at the sunrise wow, at wow. five in the morning. And we chose the song One Love by Bob Marley. And by the way, Tipi, you know why we chose One Love? Because we, uh, in this event, we had a Muslim, Christian and Jews, and the leadership of 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 uh, the, the the rabbi and 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 and, and really leader, leaders in leaders in the in of 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 all the religions, and of course the uh, the, the sheikh from Indonesia was there. We chose the this song, the one love song, because we said, you know. We all have a, a different God, okay? The, the Jews have, the, the, the Muslim have Allah, the Christian Jesus. And, and we all praying, praying in, 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 in different words. But what, uh, what make us uh, um, together that we all have one, one heart, the one love, one heart. And we all, we all loving the same. We all have, our mothers that love us and we love her and we all, and, and most of us have children that we love. And, and it's not matter what you believe, it's matter how you love. And this is why we chose one love. And you know, when I'm speaking about these words, I like, I'm really excited because- I can see. Yeah. It was a really unbelievable uh, event, and it was very spiritual. 
and mystic because of the night and because of the sunrise. Uh, it was really beautiful. Yeah. This event really gave me a hope. And it gave oh, me yeah. hope in, it, it gave me a hope in 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 people. It this event make me uh, understand that that in our society we have so many people that just afraid and 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 and, and this fear make us to be sometimes blind and to think that if someone have a different um, uh, agenda than you, it's not make him a, 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 a oyev enemy. A, enemy. It's just mean that he have a different agenda than you. And the most amazing thing that I learned in Kululam, that all what we need it's to create a, 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 a agenda together, yeah. to take my agenda and to take your agenda and yeah. to create a, a, mixed. a mixed agenda yeah, from mixed. both of us. Or and this is what we need. How can you link between the people that invite you? Because there's, there has to be something in common to everybody that asks you to come and perform in their country. It's like a sub community that we all feel the same and want the same, but they express it maybe a little bit different or not. Can you take us around this circle of people? Yeah, it's not so hard. All the people that invite Kululam or coming to the events of Kululam, there are people that dare to dream. There are people that have the courage to look on the reality and to know that we can, we can, that, that, that have more ways yeah. to, to create, to, to have a dialogue, to speak, to love. You know, love, love was, love started to be like um, a hippie's word, like a, or a schmaltz, like my grandma, my grandmother said. And you know, I, 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 I want to bring the word love again as, as a word that everybody can hugging and, 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 and say without to, to, to be afraid. That's all. I want that people will, you know, I started in the, in, and when we started the conversation, I said that what Kululam is trying to bring is a new, a new, a new language. And our new language is to, to, to have the courage to see a person that is different than you and to find what connect us, not what not what uh, uh, divide us. Yeah. Yeah. We have so many. We have so many uh, 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 reasons why to be disconnected. Yes. Yeah. Right. Yeah. But 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 you know, we we just need to find one reason why we need to connect. That's all. One reason. Right. I so, want what? No, I just wanted to ask: Are you going to meet the Pope? <laughs> <laughs> Of course, the Pope. Uh, yeah, uh, before the Corona, uh, before the COVID-19, uh, we had a really, really excited approaching by the uh, 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 Vatican, by the Vatican, by by a people that that um, organization that uh, that uh, work with the Vatican, and they wanted to uh, create an event in the Vatican with the Pope. Uh, um, event that calling uh, to people uh, um, to to see re refugees refugees and 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 to to know their stories. Um, it was really a, a exciting event for us. And three months uh, before that, uh, the the COVID nineteen came and 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 
make make us uh, at home. It was supposed to take care, it take place, I think, in October, right? Like in... Uh, uh, September or October. Yeah, September, I think. Wow. Um, maybe, and, uh, maybe, maybe you can come back to it. But it's great. It'll be, you know. We have, you know, CP, we have, we, we just started. We have so many work uh, to do in, in, in this world. And unfortunately, uh, we have so many leaders that just make us so many war, work maybe to put Maybe around. you need to have a workshop only for leaders first, lock them in some place and make them sing first a little bit, and then, and then, tour with them all over the world so we can all rest and uh, take a great and you know a good breath you, you, you know you know Tilly, i believe in humans and i believe in 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 the people and i think that if if we are as community we will understand that we have the power to change the reality Absolutely. if we understand that we have not just the power we have the responsibility to change the reality. Yep. It's so easy to, to cry and to say it's not good enough, but people don't understand that it's much more easy to change the reality. It's much more easy. It's more hard to cry about the reality. It's more easy to change it. How? If we just take ends each other and we will decide to change it it will change that's all it's well, let's keep it on this positive uh, thought yes. Yes. because it's a uh, it's strong message and we don't want to spoil it and to to lose it yeah so thank you or thank you so we much love you. thank you uh, wait uh, well, uh, so we are not going to sing together we will we will, we yeah, will. Are you three you. of us no <laughs> we will join you you will join me. One of your programs. We need Ben. We need Ben. Yeah. We need Thank ben. you so much. It was and wait, wait you. everybody who came to listen to bye, us. We'll be here next week. Say hi to Ben and Michal. I will. And bye, bye everybody. So Thank you for having me. Bye, yeah. Bye, Tim. Yeah. Bye,